It doesn't seem too long ago that SSDs were considered a luxury. Not only were they super expensive, but their capacity was fairly small, and you'd be lucky to install much more than a Windows installation on your 64GB or smaller SSD. But fast forward until 2018, and SSDs are now considered a must-have item for your rig. Whether you're a gamer, whether you're a HEDT power user, or whether you're just someone who uses Word occasionally but doesn't want your system to take 10 minutes to restart, SSDs are now a critical component of building computers. Enter the MX500 series of drives from Crucial, which are available in two distinctive form factors. The first being a 2.5 inch drive, and the second, the one that we're reviewing, is an M2 variant. Before we proceed into the review proper, do know that while this is not a sponsored video at all, and all opinions are our own, the drive itself was provided by Crucial for the purposes of review. So what about the packaging then? The drive comes in a clear clamshell case, and it's not adorned by much apart from a small sticker which tells you the basics of the drive, such as the capacity and that it is created by Crucial. There's bupkis on the rear of the packaging, and inside, other than the SSD itself of course, we have download instructions of the handy Acronis True Image and two mounting screws. It's simple and works. In terms of aesthetics of the device itself, there's not too much going on. A fairly large heatsink dominates the top of the device, with Crucial by Micron logo taking a good portion of the heat spreader, made with some type of thin metal and a smaller section listing the drive's name. A small amount of PCB can be seen on the front with the odd component sneaking through. At the rear of the drive is pretty plain in this model, with little more than a sticker with a few basic product details and best PCB and a few traces. The unit is pretty plain, with only a single access LED flashing when the drive is busy. Other than that, it's pretty plain, no garish RGB LEDs, no bright colours, just something that's functional and works, and honestly, that's not a bad thing. Other than that, you've got the small indent which is used for the mounting screw, and by the way, the drive does come with a mounting screw just in case you happen to have lost the one that comes alongside your motherboard. And installation will be simple enough. For those who have not installed an M2 drive before, if you put in RAM or graphics card, then you have all of the relevant qualifications and experience to install this. Have it facing with the heat spreader pointing upwards, plop it in at an angle of around 30-ish degrees, although this can vary depending on the motherboard, hold it in place while you screw it in, and that's about it. The MX500 drives are available in both a standard 2.5 inch form factor along with the M2 form factor that we were supplied with. Performance between the two form factors in theoretical peak performance is identical and there isn't any difference in performance with the size of the drives in terms of read or write performance either, according to Crucial. There is, however, a distinct difference in endurance, with the 250GB drive offering 100TB total bytes written, equaling to a fairly healthy 54GB per day over a total of 5 years, while the 2TB drive is up to 700TB TBW. This equals to 383GB per day, assuming the same time period. The life expectancy for this drive is rated to 1.8 million hours, so you probably won't need to replace it anytime soon. So what about the features of this then? Well, it's pretty much everything even a power user would want. Smart and device sleep support, static and wear leveling, secure erase, thermal monitoring, and finally trim or supported. But a very nice feature for those who are power users is Crucial have also taken the unusual step of adding in hardware-based AES 256-bit encryption engine. This is not something you typically see in a consumer level drive. And in addition to this, we also see RAIN, redundant array of independent NAN and exclusive data defense. RAIN is a crucial technology which sees data being saved to multiple different storage components in the drive. In theory, this works with EDD to increase protection and reliability of data. Obviously a fairly nice thing if you are dealing with mission critical information. Moving on to performance though. So what about performance then? We'll be testing the MX500 M2 against its older brother, the MX300, albeit in the 2.5 inch form factor. And we can see throughout our tests and benchmarks that yes, the MX500 does in some cases significantly outperform the older generation drive. 
managing better average, minimum, and maximum transfer speeds, both in sequential and read and random read and write scenarios. We also see lower access times to boot. And in our game load tests, where we load a act of Gears of War 4, the MX500 is slightly faster. Overall, once again, given the price point that Crucial are asking for for the MX500 drives, we think that the performance here is admirable. So, what's the overall thoughts and conclusions for the MX500? Well, our takeaway for the drive is pretty positive. The pricing for this drive is pretty darn perfect. It's available for around 50 to 60 great British pounds for the capacity that we're reviewing, which once again is 250 gigabytes, and is around 80 great British pounds for the 500 gigabyte model. Amazon affiliate links are in the video description. The 250 gigabyte drive is absolutely perfect for folks who just want the basics. For example, if they want a Windows installation, perhaps Adobe Premiere, uh, perhaps uh, Photoshop, or just Office applications in general, without a question, 250 gigabytes is absolutely amazing. Another alternative is that you could just use the 250 gigabytes for Windows installation along with the basics, and then have a different separate drive, be that mechanical or an SSD for your games. Of course, the larger capacity drives, at least in my opinion, the 500 gigabyte is probably the sweet spot in terms of the capacity versus the price, but your mileage will certainly vary. In terms of the drive's performance, it falls right in line with where you would expect. So it's certainly not going to set the world alight, but in my opinion, what really, really sets this drive apart from its competition is the feature list, which we've already been over once before, but the fact it has rain, the fact that it has uh, hardware encryption, and all of the other features just really sets it apart from the regular drive and puts it more in prosumer, at least in terms of feature set. Of course, no product is perfect. This particular drive can get rather warm. The heat spreader on it does an ample job, but if your airflow is fairly poor in your rig, it is possible that the temperature might get up there, and in which case you may see throttling. Now, this is probably only going to really happen if you're seriously thrashing the disc or you don't have really good airflow in your rig, but it is a potential possibility, particularly if your motherboard doesn't have a nice cooler on the M2 ports. Of course, if you have a higher end board, this may not be an issue, but if you have a lower end board, for example, a B360 or something along those lines, then it's possible that you may not have an M2 heat spreader. With all of that said, I wouldn't hesitate to recommend this drive to someone who is looking for an SSD in their system. One of the benefits of M2 form factor, at least in my opinion, is the fact that you don't need separate wires to go to an SSD. You don't need to uh, concern yourself with a SATA cable. You don't need to concern yourself with a power cable. All you do is simply plonk the drive directly into the motherboard, and that's pretty much it. So if you are looking for a reasonably priced SSD, we would suggest uh, the MX500 would at least be a drive that you would consider. With all of that said, hopefully you have enjoyed the video. Normal stuff, rate, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye for now.